2011, John again had an invitation for a company to come to the Grenada National Dance Festival. He was working in the US in Baltimore and got a company together and he invited myself and Beverly Glean, who are the directors of Connected Vibes UK, to come over. The preparation of uh, Grenada production was like almost seven months. We've been rehearsing this show. Um, most of the material we had already for the, from the previous show, and it's just been sharing our ideas and try to push it together that was going to represent us as dancers and you know our diversities. And, uh, and uh, yeah, I think we've done like a great job. It was it was painful sometimes, hard. It was, it was a hard show, and I felt the you know kind of have like a step towards like prof being a professional dancer. For our journey to Grenada, we did. We did lots of fundraising, it was lots to, you know, talk to people, trying to get everybody, trying, trying to talk to, to get everybody to help us. Um, it wasn't easy at times, but we did do our best, you know, always had to call in friends that um, could help us out. I, I really enjoyed the fundraising part. <laughs> teachers, share with lovers of dance and we shared that with the ministry and they helped us coordinate different um, opportunities um, and because John is one of the original founders of Connecting Vibes UK when we decided to come back this year in 2013 we saw it fit that both of the companies finally connect together. London and touring it around England to then taking it to a different country. It was quite scary, but we just went through the rehearsal period of getting everything together and tight for the project. Oh my God, you're never gonna guess what. Yesterday is Friday and I just got paid. Oh yes! I'm gonna buy myself some red, yes, red, hot, new, and
company perform wonderfully and that they complement each other. everybody's been fantastic. I think it's been a completely new experience for particularly the UK dancers. They've had to do workshops with a lot of um, people obviously that they've never met before, deal with different ages. They've performed in unfamiliar spaces, you know, obviously sometimes with some technical challenges with the floor and the size of the space and the sound, but I think they've, they've been amazing. I know that they've really enjoyed it. I think it's been a real learning curve for them and they've also really enjoyed meeting the CV USA dancers, uh, the museum rehearsal space when the two companies first came together and they shared their work and there was just such a good um, vibe in the room. There's a lot of enthusiasm and energy between the two companies. Two I like to the visit, I would say okay, Grenada is beautiful and um, I think like meeting, connecting vibes USA. Getting to meet um, people from the ministry. Meeting the US company and working with children. The performance, the performances, um, um, connect the vibes US and get to know how they work, how they dance, and also um, the workshops with um, uh, John and Valerie. Probably the most exciting day was for me when we went to rehearse at Grenada National Museum. Getting to do um, uh, Caribbean dance in an actual Caribbean country, that felt so good, it felt so natural. sharing learning experience. In fact, some, okay, some of the experience in one word, I would say um, intense. Inspiring the experience altogether, was, I would say, was very inspiring. But for me, it will be life-changing. Amazing. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Sport of the special, what the 